will kind of dissipate over the next few hours. There is a freeze warning in effect for northwestern Virginia that includes Orange, Madison, and Culpeper counties and points farther north and west. Nothing within the CBS6 viewing area, but we may have a few pockets north and west, especially near Louisa, parts of Cumberland County, Flavana counties, Goochland County. They get down pretty close to maybe a smidge below freezing for a brief period. Close to 40 near the coast, about 35 to 39 across the metro tonight. And then high temperatures for tomorrow range from the 50s near the coast, low and mid 60s across central Virginia to some 70s in far southwestern Virginia. Sun's up at 618, 44 at 9 o'clock, 53 at noon, and a high of 64, so about 6 degrees cooler than today. Still a little bit breezy, but the gusts won't be as strong as they were today. Here's our seven day temperature trend. So we're looking at highs back closer to 70 for Friday and Saturday. We get into low 70s on Sunday, and then here we go back into the low 80s. We're not looking for any temperatures near 90 like we saw on Sunday, but temperatures actually going back above normal for a few days there for about the first half of next week. And precipitation wise, we're dry the next few days. Just a slight chance of a shower, a thunderstorm Sunday into Monday, a slightly better chance on Tuesday. In fact, it looks to be a pretty decent chance of a few showers Sunday night. Well, that'd be mostly why everyone is sleeping. But here's a look at our seven day forecast 64 tomorrow, 39 tomorrow night, close to 70 on Friday and Saturday, some low 70s Sunday with a slight chance of a shower. Slightly better chances of some thunderstorms by the time we get towards Tuesday. But notice the overnight lows start to warm up through the upper 50s and low 60s. Daytime highs get into the low 80s.